Hello, I'm back for part two to the urgent prayer request that I put up earlier. And I tell you, I'm so dumb. I should have done all this so much earlier. But at least this, this young lady has um, tonight's um, rent paid for her motel. She's staying at a quality inn. And I wanted to put up. I want to give you the telephone number for the Quality Inn, and she said I could give you her name and number, and you could call and talk to her directly. And if some of you have are of financial means where you could cover a night for her or wire her some money for some food for her children, if you don't have enough for a night stay or whatever, Anything you could do would be most helpful. You know we're all looking forward to the rapture coming. Hopefully, you know, by Halloween. I mean, if it doesn't happen, I, I can't picture it. But I'm not, I'm not, I'm not the one who heard it from the Lord. I'm just very, 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 very hopeful, okay? So, her name is Shonda. Uh, her phone number... 786-348-8590. I'll put these in the description box. She's at the Quality Inn, room 136, and their phone number is 770-623-9300. And she was saying something about she couldn't just call and give a credit card number over the phone anymore. You have to ask them to send you via email an authorization form and then you email them your information I didn't even know they were doing that now so if there's anything you can do to help please pray please pray to see if the Lord would lay it on your heart to help this young lady to take care of her children until she can find a, a permanent situation over there where she's uh, she's in, in the Atlantic area. Okay, Atlanta. Somewhere around there. Okay, anyway. Um, that's all I have to say. I've been fretting about this all day, and I don't know until I sat down and actually started praying. It just goes to show you. When, you. when you take the time to pray about something... Instead of trying to work it out for yourself, the Lord will start telling you stuff to do. He told me to make a video and ask for prayer. That's why I did that one. Then I started praying in the Spirit and just crying out to the Lord, saying, Lord, what can, what can I do? What can I do? He said, you know, get this information and put it up on YouTube. There's got to be some people. So I'm counting on some folks that have the money to please, please help this young lady. Or maybe you have suggestions of what she can do. Maybe you've been in this situation before and you can tell her what you did. Okay? That would help too. Prayers, suggestions, financial assistance, whatever you can do. God bless you for it. I plead the blood of Jesus over this video, over the internet connection, and over every single one of you, every one of my subscribers. In Jesus' name, I pray that for you. Bye-bye for now.